into this computer starts now. Hey, welcome everyone to the Teller Miner meeting, uh, Teller Dev Calls, November 26th, 2019. Um, so just for the basic updates for everyone. Um, the first thing, so some of you noticed that we did a release of the miner, so just kind of a preliminary release. Um, so the minor release that came out, uh, you can update it. You may, as of now, you don't need to, to update it. Basically, we provided now a Mac binary because a few people requested it. Um, not that a Mac's really any good right now for mining, um, but hey, if you want to spin it up, by all means, uh, please go for it. And then the other thing, uh, we changed the gas limit. So uh, some of that fifth solution uh, it has some higher gas prices, and on the test net, it actually started failing. So you would have, you would have this weird scenario where it would the gas cost would only be like eight hundred thousand, but even submitting with a hundred thousand gas limit or a million gas limit, you would actually fail out. And I did some research into solidity, and the way that this works is that um, some of the times so the miners will use estimate gas on your contract to see if you provided enough gas to do it. And since we use some delegate calls, kind of that whole weird uh, upgradable structure, they actually can't uh, estimate it properly. So they will sometimes just say, hey, you don't have enough. Um, so that's where it comes from. So we actually need to over estimate the amount of gas. It's a problem, it was a problem on the test net but it is currently not a problem on the main net. Uh, but if you want to upgrade just to be safe, you can do that. Um, so yeah, that was, that was a nice easy one. Other pieces that are coming through. Um, the, uh, the big minor update that we're doing, so we have some work done on the GPU miner. Um, we're going to have the GPU miner. We're going to bring that to you guys for Christmas. So expect a GPU miner or at least an MVP version um, by Christmas. So, so what that means is if you are renting out really expensive CPUs, um, if you're planning on buying a new CPU, just, just know that it may not be the best investment decision because hopefully you'll be able to, to use some GPUs here from January. So um, just keep that in mind. Um, also, once we do push the GPUs, we expect a lot of kind of the profile of miners to change because it'll there are a lot of GPU mining pools. There's a lot of um, kind of people who specialize in GPU mining of cryptocurrencies. And um, if our token continues to grow as we think it will, uh, they might come on and it should provide a lot of additional demand for our token as they need money to stake. Um, but just also be aware that it it could also just cause a, a whole shift in kind of the who the top miners are now will probably not be so in come a month or so. All right. Um, other things that we're doing uh, the teller scan updates. So we have um, one guy, he's working for tributes, which you guys can all do, and he's doing some updates to teller scan. Um, I'll let you know when he actually pushes them, but we're going to be adding some charts. So hopefully you'll have a, a difficulty chart. You're gonna have some of those minor charts. Um, he's just gonna make kind of a more useful teller scan. So if you guys wanna help him out, let me know. Um, and just keep checking there for some updates. Um, another announcement. So we are actually in the process of documenting it, but we created an API for you guys. So I'm going to share my screen here. Um, how do I share my screen? Share, there we go. Um, all right, so you guys should be able to see my screen. So we're gonna push out some uh, documentation on this, but basically we, we just made a simple API. If you're into creating a more robust API and wanna help us out, definitely come do that. It's all open source on GitHub, but you can just type in API.tellerscan 
com slash info and it will return you kind of the main variables of the system. We just wanted something simple because people were requesting it. So you can come here, you can hit it, store it to a database, uh, the number of stakers, the difficulty, current request ID, dispute count, total supply, time of last new value, and then request count. So just uh, some basic things. Um, the other thing that we're letting you do is also get the current price. So yeah, you can look up price and then the request ID, so one, and it'll give you whether or not it did get it, the value, um, and the timestamp retrieved. So, and this is the request ID. So you can do it with two and you get something else. Um, yeah, so if you guys wanna help that help us make that better, um, continue to do so, or if you wanna just start pulling and making prices, uh, we'll have the documentation up on GitHub. So definitely look for that. Um, should make things easier for you. Um, other things, uh, there's a Teller 101 article if you didn't see it. Uh, pass it around, help us share it. Um, Mike, right there, he put it together. Um, it should be a nice little simple thing for you guys to look at. Um, also just an easy explainer to pass around to people if they're ever wondering, okay, what is Teller and, and why is it kind of important? Uh, the another, another announcement that we can sort of make, I think we make it now. Uh, so we are up on Radar Relay. So that's a big one. Um, Radar is a DEX. Uh, the big reason we wanted Radar is they're US-based DEX. Uh, so there's no need for US people to VPN anymore, um, which is really cool. The other thing, uh, we've known the Radar guys for quite a while. Um, there's some cool guys um, doing a lot of stuff in the space and they have a really, really slick UI um, if you want to use it. So I placed an order up there. We'll be doing kind of a more formal announcement tomorrow with them. Um, so yeah, but if you want to be one of the first people to go uh, place an order on Radar Relay and you watch this, now's your opportunity. So um, yeah, go have fun with it. Um, hopefully we can drive some volume there and, and get some more people in. Uh, last, a few more things, you know, kind of, as I was saying before on the teller scan piece, if, if you want to work for tributes, um, let us know, you know, we have a lot of dev tasks, a lot of issues, either either in Solidity, uh, in Golang, if you want to help on the minor, or in JavaScript slash React, if you want to help out with teller scan. Um, that's about it for the developers announcements. Um, thing I'll be pushing this week and next, um, December 12th here in Washington, DC. We're doing an event, um, just kind of going over uh, the crypto space in general. So if you guys want to, to come meet the team or anything and you're in the DC area, um, definitely reach out to me and we'll send you an invite. So thanks everyone for joining. Are there any questions? You guys can type them, blurt them out loud, let me know. All right, doesn't look like it. Um, Hope, uh, yeah, hope everyone has a nice Thanksgiving holiday if you're here in the U.S. And we shall talk to you guys soon. All right, see you, everyone.